What's up, guys? Welcome back to another Epi. Ben, what are we doing today? We're going to be making the, the DIY afternoon snack. It's going to be great. Okay, guys, so this is going to be the yummiest snack you've ever had, right? Yeah, it's completely do-it-yourself. Uh, you just need a few materials, and I pro it's going gonna, it's gonna to be the tastiest afternoon snack that you've ever had in your life. I can promise you that. Yeah. From me to you, from me to you, I can promise. What's going to be in this bowl in just a few short minutes... It's going to be the tastiest thing that you have... Been. What are you doing? I'm trying to Help. talk to them. Help. I'm trying to talk to them. You get, your head stuck in the, you get your head stuck in a hoodie. Help! Oh my god. It's so embarrassing. You should be embarrassed. Okay guys, so step one, uh, get a ben, bottle ben, and, ben, and you just want to shove it. Ben! See how it's... We're not doing this today. Wrong video. Oh, okay guys, so... Let's get started. The first step... Is a bowl. Is a bowl. Grab a bowl big, because you're going to want to make a lot of this snack. You're going to want to use just a, your average cheese cracker. You're just going to want to like dump a fair amount. Yep. Like. And we kind of forgot a fork so we can mash. So we're just going to be creative. You just like. landed that. <sighs> Okay, you're gonna want to use a tube of granite to smash That's these. That's the only way you can make the snack correctly. I mean, you could probably... <laughs> <laughs> Guys, the key is, you're gonna want to break them into very tiny pieces. Guys, they might come out of the bowl, but you know, that's just all part of the, um... See, after it's kind of small like this, can't really- oh no. You're getting it everywhere. Oh, okay, I'm sorry. What's your problem? Guys, just take them with your fingers. Take them with your fingers! I have to like, you know. Like, hold the bowl. Or guys, you could just roll it out like a steamroller. Yeah, just with your piece of granite that you have just like, like laying Logan. around. Next step, you're gonna grab some butt. That's right. Uh, there's only a little left, guys, but you see how small these pieces are? Cheese on Ben. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Everywhere. Just grab a handful of the booty. That is a great amount. It looks delicious so far, but just wait till you see we get to the other ingredients. Mm, yeah. Let's get crushing. This isn't working as well as the um the cheese is. It's kind of firm. Yeah, we might, we might have to break it up with our hands because it's just too firm. Since it's way too firm, you're gonna want to just smush it with your hands. Oops. Try and get it into really small pieces. Oh, they can't see the bowl. See, so crush it up and then sprinkle it over. So you can even crush it up with the cheese it and it'll work just fine. <clears throat> you okay? Now it's disgusting and all over our hands, but that's really what it's supposed to be like. This is what it looks like so far. I know you probably can't see it that well. But, but um, now we add goldfish. A fair amount of goldfish. Whole grain is the best way to do it, guys. And just take your piece of granite that you have lying around. And then you just want to crush it. Now you're just going to want to roll it out again. Just wait till you see the last ingredient. A though, delicious boys. snack. No, the last thing you're going to want to do is you got to add the chocolate powder. That's right. This is like the, the final mix. touch. You need a lot of it. Like maybe like. like oh my God. My mom was going to be like, oh, so that's what happened to the Ovaltine. I need to vacuum this blanket when I get done. Obviously, I really don't think you guys are going to want to use your granite to stir because it'll make it too fine and it'll make it like really soft when it goes down your throat, so. Okay, so you're just going to want to mix all the chocolate in. Gotta make sure they can see that. Make sure it spreads nice and even. You want everything to be covered with chocolate powder. As you can see here, we have... It's looking see, pretty tasty. You're going to want to like flip it too. Right. feels so good on my hands. Guys. It does. Get in there. Guys, your hand is going to get a little dirty like this. There's no clean in DIY. Okay, we got to like go wash our hands before we eat this. Cringy bad jokes. Okay. This is our joke set sec this is our joke segment of the video, so I just have a few jokes for you guys, and I just want to share it. What do you call a mix between a dog and a cat? A cog. <laughs> Here's your spoon. 
That was so awkward. Alright guys, are you ready for the DIY snack food challenge? Ugh. Oh, that's so good. You gotta get all of it in. Why did we make this? I'm scared to take a bite. <laughs> It's really chocolatey. <laughs> like, overwhelmingly chocolatey. <laughs> Take a big bite. It's so bad. <laughs> yeah, we won't let it go to waste. Uh. What do we do with it? Oh crap, I just realized. The cinnamon rolls. Yeah, there's four minutes left. Oh, there is. Okay. okay, let's put this here and film the outro. So bad. All right guys, so that is gonna wrap it up for the DIY. I hope you guys enjoyed it was a really yummy snack And it was really fun to make I hope we've taught you guys a lot of stuff about afternoon snacks and Making good ones like that was so good wasn't it? I, I have to be honest it was the best thing that I've ever had like I just think that time We made it better than all the other times that we've made it together. Yep. What was it like 30 other times? Uh, like 32 anyway it was the best so far. Now, please make the subscribe button gray and make the like button blue. Gray and blue. <sighs> yeah. Favorite colors, actually. So. Really? That's why my, that's why my walls are blue. That's kind of lame. Like, to be honest, though. Yeah. Alright, guys, but that's it for the video. If you want more DIYs, drop a like. It means so much to us. Okay, bye. <laughs> I'm in